Shark mating is a fascinating and diverse topic, with different species exhibiting a wide range of behaviors and reproductive strategies. Let's delve deeper into the intriguing world of shark mating. Sharks, being ancient and diverse creatures, have evolved various mating strategies to ensure the survival of their species. Courtship behaviors are often a crucial part of shark mating rituals. These behaviors can include swimming together in a synchronized manner, rubbing against each other, and even nipping or biting gently. These actions help establish compatibility and readiness for mating. Male sharks possess specialized reproductive organs called claspers. Claspers are modified pelvic fins located on the inner side of the male's body near the pelvic area. During mating, the male shark inserts one or both of its claspers into the female's cloaca, which is the common opening for the reproductive and excretory systems. This enables the male to transfer sperm directly into the female's reproductive tract. Fertilization in sharks is internal, which means that the female's eggs are fertilized within her body. This internal fertilization mechanism is believed to provide the developing embryos with a better chance of survival in the challenging marine environment. Once fertilized, the female's reproductive system begins the process of nurturing the embryos. The gestation period for shark embryos varies greatly among species, ranging from a few months to over a year. Some species are oviparous, which means they lay eggs. These eggs, often enclosed in protective cases sometimes referred to as mermaids' purses, are deposited in various marine habitats. The embryos develop inside these cases until they are ready to hatch. Other shark species are viviparous, meaning they give birth to live young. In viviparous species, the developing embryos are sustained through a placental connection or by consuming unfertilized eggs or other embryos within the mother's uterus. This internal nurturing provides the growing sharks with essential nutrients and protection. Once the gestation period is complete, female sharks give birth to their offspring. Depending on the species, the number of pups born can vary significantly. Some species give birth to just a few pups, while others may have litters of a dozen or more. In conclusion, shark mating is a complex and diverse process that showcases the remarkable adaptations these creatures have developed to ensure the continuation of their species. From courtship behaviors to internal fertilization and various reproductive strategies, shark mating reflects the incredible diversity of life in the oceans.